Welcome to this presentation of Yoga vs. Tai Chi. Yoga and Tai Chi intersect in a variety of ways. They share many of the same mental and physical benefits, and they both come from the Eastern canon of integrated mind-body practices. Tai Chi emerged in China, while Yoga emerged in India. They are both approximately 5,000 years old. They both integrate breath control, meditation, and poses in their practice to facilitate health and longevity. Both practices also acknowledge the existence and importance of life force management to ensure good health and longevity. Qi in Tai Chi and Prana in Yoga. But Tai Chi and Yoga do differ in significant ways. First, they differ in intent. Tai Chi focuses on managing energy for complete health and longevity. It is also a martial art form intended for use in combat, though it has been tweaked into a form of slow meditative movement, now widely used for health and wellness. Yoga focuses only on health to facilitate a full union of mind, body, spirit, and enlightenment. The practice is inherently nonviolent. The methods differ as well. While both Tai Chi and Yoga apply breath, movement, and meditation for whole health, how they apply them differs. Yoga aligns poses with the breath, and in traditional Hatha Yoga, poses are also held for a certain number of breaths. Tai Chi encourages practitioners to breathe slowly and deeply, but not to consciously align movement and breath. Tai Chi also consists of slow flowing movements that are choreographed to flow into one another. They are never held. While both practices improve physical strength, endurance, and both are low impact forms of exercise, yoga can be much more physically demanding than Tai Chi. Many of yoga's intermediate and advanced poses require significant levels of strength and flexibility to perform. Tai Chi may be done by any age group of almost any fitness level. Most Tai Chi movements are performed slowly from a standing position and take the body through its natural range of motion. Yoga encourages an expansion of flexibility and strength through preparatory stretches, poses, and visualization to attain more advanced poses when possible. People who practice yoga or Tai Chi experience similar results, including decreased stress, improved cardiovascular and respiratory health, gains in strength and flexibility, decreased anxiety and depression, and gains in cognitive function. The degree to which the physical gains occur will most likely differ. Yoga demands more physical acumen of its practitioners. Studies have also shown Tai Chi to support the functional capacity of women with breast cancer, prevent strokes in high-risk patients, and to ease post-stroke symptoms. Tai Chi also helps with symptoms of Parkinson's disease. When choosing to practice yoga or Tai Chi, consider the following. Do you want your mind-body practice to focus on physical and mental health and general wellness, or would you like more of a spiritual engagement within your practice? How physically fit are you? Yoga tends to be more physically demanding. Tai Chi or yoga does not have to be practiced at the exclusion of the other. They complement one another beautifully with Tai Chi boosting meditation progress and yoga improving physical strength and flexibility more rapidly. Whether you choose to practice yoga or Tai Chi, you will experience significant mental and physical benefits. Both practices provide an integrated healthcare and healing system for practitioners. The most popular type of Tai Chi is 24 form that only takes six minutes to complete once learned. So it can easily be implemented into a diverse fitness regimen that also includes yoga or any other form of exercise.